What's up guys and welcome back to Ratchet and Clank 3 Up Your Arsenal. In the last episode we found Monkey Cork and now we are at some type of starship that some Vox Lady. I don't really know too much about what's going on right now. But hey, we do have all of our weapons stolen. We're running around here. Are these bad guys? No, they're not. Okay. Um, ooh, we can maybe buy stuff. Do we have enough uh, bullets for that new weapon? We don't. And there's even more new weapons. Alright, we gotta... I, whoa, what is this? One time only, Gadgetron offers a special discount to former Gadgetron employees. Select this option to check your hard disk. I, I should have that. Let's check it out. So it looks like I get a 10% discount on all Gadgetron weapons. Okay, I can't complain. You unlocked a new skin. Oh. All right, so I just got stuff that is cheaper because... Oh, and I can test these things out too. Okay, then. Oh, wow, that's significantly cheaper. This was 15000 before. All right, then, let's buy this. Yes. All righty, then. We're buying up some weapons pretty easy now. <laughs> That'll actually be really helpful. That's awesome. All right, then. This is what we just bought, too. This is just like a normal blaster, which is weird because usually the game hands you the blaster first things first. Hmm. Hi, guys. How are you? Wait, what? Is oh, is this an armor stand? I'm guessing. This is our onboard Gadgetron armor vendor. We'll notify you whenever a new suit of armor is available for purchase. All right, cool. Oh, <laughs> gosh. Monkey Cork is just following me around. It's sort of creepy. Look at him slowly walking. The... Yeah, I'm going to get him there eventually. It's going to keep walking. <laughs> All right, what is this about? Um, Is this a door to anywhere? It is. I don't know where, <laughs> where we're supposed to go right now. Let's pull up the map a bit. Um, There's a trophy room, play vid comic, VR deck, armor vendor. I think we'll just have to go down there. I don't really know. I guess this is sort of like a hub area is what I'm gathering here, which is odd, very odd. I'm sure we'll be back here at some point then. Um, all right, yeah, let's go down this way. Please take Cork to the cage in your quarters. Oh. And then meet me on the bridge. Oh, okay, wait, which one's my quarters? Uh, none of these seem to be that, but I'll, I'll try. So let's check out what we got here. Um, this is a trophy room apparently, where we have no trophies. This is the Phoenix trophy room. Whenever a crew member is awarded a Medal of Honor, it is displayed here. This is the Phoenix VR deck. Here you can train in combat simulations or practice using new gadgets. Huh, that's cool. Do we get anything unlocked for doing that? There's a lot of questions to ask with this one. I set up the VG9000 to play vid comic discs. Poor monkeys all locked up. Banana. That's tasting. Uh, oh, <laughs> monkey cork. Hi. Oh boy. Banana, yum. Ew, he ate the peel too? That's just gross. How do you think he got like this? Well, the life of an intergalactic superhero can be very stressful. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, you're telling me this nutcase is our only hope for stopping Nefarious? <laughs> We're hosed. Indeed we are. I don't know how well things are going to turn out, but I just love how I can freely enter the cage, but he's too buff to get through. Then what's going on? I guess this is where we could sleep. Okay. Cool stuff, then. This is actually really awesome. Uh, and there's a normal quirk, pic pic quirk picture. This is the VG game system. If you had a vid comic. What the heck is a vid comic? I have no clue. <laughs> All right, then. Let's go back to where we're supposed to be. Let's go. Uh... I'm moving. Whoa, this is moving. This is a weird episode so far. I know, I know, I know. I've been doing it all game. <laughs> oh, geez. This is really cool, though. Like, it's just weird. Unorthodox for Russian and Clank. It's usually just constantly action. We're losing the signal. Try boosting the power. Isn't that the president? They came out of nowhere. Tyrannoid invasion force. Presidential compound has been breached. Cannot hold out much longer here. Mr. President. Dad! Are you there? Oh no! Robotic citizens of the Solana Galaxy. The hour of your liberation is at hand! Too long have we robots suffered under the bigotry, the stupidity, the squishiness and foul stench of organic life forms. Soon, all robots will bask in the liberty and equality of my benevolent, iron-fisted rule. And, as for you filthy organic life forms, you can look forward to being disintegrated! <laughs> That's all for now. 
<laughs> I love how the butler's doing the sign language. Plot a course from Arcadia. Maximum speed. Prepare the dropship for planetary assault. We're going in. We'll see you on Arcadia. Okay then, download coordinates for Capital City Planet Markadia. This is very interesting. Okay, the Nefarious is already outdoing his nefarious deeds. What would you know? So now we gotta go and deal with him. All right, let's go. All right then, so we can go to Markadia. Of course, there are different missions we can still do in Florana. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. All right then, we still have to. Uh... Well, right now it looks like our main mission is to fly to Markadia. So this this is different. Before it would list your missions for that planet, but now it just sort of lists your current mission. So let's fly to Arcadian. So Arcadia looks pretty cool. And it sort of looks like Mars or something, which I like. But obviously we can see some water or something there. So let's go. Ooh. Ooh, I like it, even though it looks a little torn up. Hmm. Glad you made it, sir. The presidential compound is on the other side of the city. Keep your head down. The turnoids are crawling all over the place. Oh, no. Here we go. How to deal with the tyranoids. All right. Well, first, of course, we need to get ourselves some bolts here. But hopefully, <laughs> we get a lot of action in these next few minutes because I'm getting a little bored of all this talking. Okay, then. So we got some expensive weapons up ahead. We got the Spitting Hydra, Sarcanid, and Infector. All right. Cool stuff. Cool stuff. Okay. Hmm. What is off this way? Oh, oh, oh geez. I see your blood. <laughs> geez. I don't even want to know. Okay. Um... Hmm, what should we use here? I definitely want to use whatever I can to level up, but we got ourselves our uh, one weapon here that's pretty close to a level up. But I do need to make sure I get ammo as soon as I can. Here, take you guys. These guys are much bigger, too. Okay. Ooh, ooh. Okay, good. <laughs> I'm still trying to not spend as much money on ammo as I possibly Whoa! Where'd they go? <laughs> Was that all the help I get? Really? All right. But I'm trying to spend as little money as possible on ammo just because I would like to keep track of it this time. Whoa! <laughs> That was a lo wrong long jump. Tap triangle to cycle through the last three weapons you have equipped. Oh really? Is it three now? That's actually pretty handy. Cool. Alrighty then. So this is. Crate multiplies all bolts and experience gained for a limited time. That's actually really cool then. All right then, let's take these guys out. <laughs> Roll on through them. Okay, come on, come on. For a limited time only. So we got to make sure we do this as fast as possible. It's actually cool though. It's like. I don't know, there's already a lot of additions to this game, which I like a lot. Um, this still is pretty close to an upgrade. It's about halfway there. Dang it, don't die, don't die. My, my nanotech did upgrade there, but it doesn't refool your health all the way, all the way. Or all the way anymore. I don't know why I can't speak right. But I'm pretty sure it used to do that. It used to be able to refill your health once you got the nanotech upgrade. All right, break that. And then, hmm, make sure we get all the uh, health and bolts we can possibly get. Ooh, what did I find? Something. Wait a minute. Huh, there's like a little side pocket thing here. Um, hmm. Can I, is this transporter? Will this bring me somewhere? No, okay. <laughs> All right then, I guess it doesn't have much of a purpose. There seems to be some little pocket areas over here as well. So we gotta make sure we get everything. I'm not missing any secrets at the beginning of the game at the least. <laughs> okay, get all that kind of stuff. Well, at least everything we can get without having to backtrack. Hmm, that looks to be just about everything. Wait. Okay. <laughs> All right, let's go. I know we do have our swimming ability now, but there doesn't seem to be anything. Oh, whoa, what was that? What was that? Whoa. I don't even know. I, okay. I'm gonna leave the water alone for now. We got this guy we gotta deal with. He's much more important. Oh, oh. Well, now he's dead, so he isn't very important at all. <laughs> okay. Take him out, take him out. Yeah. It is just feeling really good to play a Ratchet game again, though. I really missed it. I feel like. With all the hype coming for the new Ratchet game and all the gameplay we've been receiving recently, because it just seems to be more and more uh, gameplay content just sort of releasing about it, it gets me so excited, and it just looks really, really cool. I'm about to die, I'm about to die. Is there any health around here? I don't think so. Uh, okay, go this way, go this way. Ready, boom, okay. And then, oh, there's some health, there's some health. Uh, get this, I see a pot in the bolt up there, silver bolt. No, titanium, that's what it is. <laughs> okay, let's see, let's see if we can't deal with that guy. Hmm. Yo, let's do the nitro launcher. Boom. Yeah, I got him. No, no, don't do it. <laughs> okay. Um, let's do something a little more long range, like our new weapon, the N60 Storm. Come on now. Ooh, ooh. Oh no, darn it. Oh, no good. All right, what is up here? Uh, a whole bunch of nothing it's looking like, but there is a bolt over here. How can we get this? Um, I don't know if I can make this jump over to try. Nah, not quite. Hmm, let's try this. Wait. Ooh. Come on, come on. Ah, oh, nah, I can't. 
I don't know, maybe there's some special thing we can do to get up there, but for now I cannot. They're gonna drop down another person, so let's get ready for him. I know this just got a V2 right at the end of the last episode, so that's nice and cool. This is still on, and this is still on V2 as well, but it's getting close to not being on V2. And then this, of course, still needs a lot to go. Because we just got it. But I'll be trying my best, like last last playthrough of Ratchet 2, we definitely didn't get all the weapons, and I didn't really like that, but at the same time, a lot of them costed like millions and millions of bolts, so that wasn't very pleasant. So I want to be able to change that. I'll try to change it as much as I can, but I'm definitely not gonna grind, you know, for hours for bolts, because that's just not fun in my opinion. Hmm, let's go over. Oh wait, maybe we can get up here like that? Hmm. All right, well, I think we could have gotten up here anyways, but worth a try to be smart like that. No, whoa, okay, for a moment I totally thought I fell. Oh, geez. Hmm. It's still really cool to think, though, that I'm, like, I'm really starting to get through all of the PlayStation classics I've ever wanted to play on the channel. Like, this will be the last, one of the last, if not, like, second to last. You know, I'm still deciding if I want to do Deadlocked after this, but, um, or eventually, really. But it's weird to think, besides that, I've let's played all the Jack and Daxter games, I've let's played now nearly all the Ratchet and Clank games that are out on the PS2, and then after that, it's like, what else really is there? I mean, the Sly Cooper games I definitely want to do, maybe the Thai games, but at the same time, I've never really played them that much, I've played a little bit of Thai 1, and that's it. Nice shooting, sir. A second wave of Terranoids just landed. They're attacking the compound from the other side. We could sure use your help. You got it. Follow me to the dropship. But yeah, that's all I was saying. <laughs> Looks like we gotta make our way to the dropship. <laughs> Follow me, now nah, you're on your own, buddy, sorry. <laughs> now nah, we'll help him out a bit here. And... All right, with whatever ammo we have left of this, use it up as well as we can, and then use the nitro launcher, and just really quickly, to take care of one of them, if not a few. And then you, ooh, excuse me, pardon me. <laughs> But I just remember seeing Ratchet 2 and 3 when I was a kid, thinking they looked really, really fun. And it's just awesome to finally be able to play through these games. It's just, I don't know, that's sort of the fun thing. If, if people say, oh, it's no fun being an adult, there's one thing that's really fun about it. And this might sound like the childish thing in the world, but you can buy whatever video games you want. <laughs> Nobody can tell you no. All right, let's get these crates before we hop into that little, um, that rocket ship over there. Oh, come on, come on. There you go, good stuff. And then let's go in. Ooh. Yeah, okay, here we are. All right then, what are the, oh, this, oh, we're doing a battle. All right then, Operation Iron Shield, part one. Drive through, drive the Tyranoids. I always have our, Tyranoids? Yeah, I think so. Out of the compound, then defend the area against a series of brutal attacks. All right, let's do it. And off we go. <laughs> That's a really cool ship, I like that one. So we're heading over to some type of battle? This is really weird, but okay. I don't have a problem with it, it's still cool. All right, let's fight some Tyranoids. Just in time, we must defend the presidential palace. All right, let's... There's a lot of weird stuff. Hey, look, our ammo got refilled. Or that, or we just got that much ammo. I don't know, hmm, weird. Uh, let's see. Uh... Okay, yeah, I think all of our ammo got refilled. Cool stuff, okay. We gotta take care of as many of these guys as we can then. Reinforcements, oh no! All right, let's get this health as much as we can. Got a nitro launcher, apparently. Um, hmm, there they are, there they are indeed. Let's use the whip, the whip is always cool. I'm sort of <laughs> being a little bit more even spread about my weapon usage this time around, at least for right now. Ooh, ooh, ooh get that slam, it actually has some pretty good range to it if you can angle it up just right. Hmm, ooh, take those guys out, cool. Whoa, little guys, hey, <laughs> goodbye. All right, it does actually run out of ammo when you're really trying to combo it up though. Whoa, <laughs> what are you on? <laughs> are you just like go-karting? Oh, I cannot hit him. Darn it, okay, whoa, jump! <laughs> I cannot strafe either, um, there we go, come on. Ooh, yeah, no, 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 no! Oh geez, big guys, big guys. <laughs> we'll take him out. It's cool to have like a bigger open area like this, so it sort of gives you like more room to breathe, because a lot of ratchet levels are a lot more linear, so it's just cool to see sort of an open area. All right, get that. All right, come on, ooh, ooh. Darn it, no, okay, for a moment there I thought I died, but I have one more health left, so I'm gonna run off this way, and then boom, okay? And then these guys are over that way, they're spawning in more of these little buddies. <laughs> get him out of here. I'm about to get to level two though. Let's see if I can't take him out before he shoots at me, because if he does, they're sort of hard to dodge. Oh, there we go, there's that level up I was looking for. And that will be, okay then, V3. An upgrade features a lock-on mod. To lock on to enemies, press and hold. All right, cool, so whoa, 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 whoa. So I gotta do L2 and R2. 
That's really weird, but it's also really cool. So now the upgrade sort of, besides, you know, damage or fire rate or something like that, mission accomplished, reward 3,000 bullets. Actually, that's cool. All right, so there are more missions to do, but we will hold them off until the next episode. For now, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Ratchet & Clank Up Your Arsenal. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure to give this video a like, share with your friends and family, and comment in the comment section below. If you watched this point in the video, make sure you comment Zebra Clank, so I know you've watched at the end of the video, and that you're a Zebra Tazzy viewer. But either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you next time. Bye-bye.